Firefighters rushed to put out a fire early this morning at an Edmond business. It's the second time they battled flames in that area in as many days. And as News Force Natalie Clydesdale reports, it wasn't just the fire crews were worried about. Well, fire officials say crews were able to put out the flames quickly, but the buildings behind me did suffer significant damage. There's going to be substantial damage. What you see on the outside is kind of what you get on the out inside, plus a lot more. Fire crews rushed to Boucher Drive near I-35 in Waterloo around 7 o'clock Monday morning. We received multiple calls, 911 calls, some black smoke coming from a structure over here. We we're able to make entry and go in, put the fire out relatively quickly. It's the second time firefighters battled flames here in two days. Saturday we, we had a fire here in the building located behind this. It did get into this front building. We actually have two buildings, two metal buildings here, two separate businesses. Chris Denton of the Edmond Fire Department says the building in the back is a total loss from Saturday's inferno. The front building is a specialty coating business, so there were potentially dangerous chemicals inside. Some xylenes in there, there's some uh, urethane coatings, we have some motor oils, some types of stuff like that. Thankfully, they do have this out and they were able to uh, you know, protect those chemicals against the fire that was on the inside. So good news there. That building also significantly damaged. Investigators still working to figure out how the fire started. We're not sure uh, why that happened. So we'll be looking at that um, again. Natalie Clydesdale, Oklahoma's News 4. And the most important thing here, fire investigators say no one was hurt in the fire.